The following is made possible by the ARPIN Group and by Renewable Now. The International Society of Sustainability Professionals presents ISSP Profiles in Excellence, where leaders in sustainability share their experience so that others may learn. In this edition, we feature Jeff Yorzik of Cardno. My name is Jeff Yorzik. I'm an ISSP board member. Uh, I've been here in Colorado for about 20 years now and in the sustainability industry really my entire career for about 22 years now. So ISSP I found out about through a friend of mine who's also a sustainability practitioner and what really drew me to ISSP was that there was a community of practitioners here. Uh, when I was in graduate school, I found a group called Net Impact at one point and went to a big conference and realized these are really good ideas. These are business ideas and these are real ideas. Uh, and I wasn't kind of crazy and this person who kept talking about things that nobody understood very well. So big member benefits that I see for ISSP really are, number one, that network of like-minded individuals and a network that we can feel like we're a part of, a part of a community, uh, and a group that we can really drain support from. Uh, and I find those to be very important things. But furthermore, uh, a group that can support each other, that we can find uh, education, resources, uh, all, all the kinds of things that we need in our professional lives to both further our careers and our own professional development. So where I really believe ISSP has a unique position in the world is in creating some way of really standardizing the profession of sustainability uh, and really creating some kind of a body of knowledge around which many of us can gather that employers can really understand as a known quantity when they're hiring someone that has an ISSP certification. And so the real value I see long term for ISSP is not just a certification someone can get, but again that community where they go back to for ongoing professional development, where they network, where they really get more of a profession out of it rather than just some career development. A lot of my passion for sustainability is, is part of the reason I ended up in Colorado. Um, many of us who work in sustainability had some kind of a personal moment in time. Uh, mine was down in the Telluride area of Colorado in 1992 where I had an extremely powerful experience up in the mountains where I got a very visceral feeling of how dare I do anything with my career other than protect and preserve this. And so that's really driven me into sustainability help is one of the reasons I moved to Colorado. Uh, and so a lot of my passion comes from being out in the mountains and, and really um, experiencing nature, but then bringing that back and sharing that with my friends and my family and the people I love and talking with them about that and that, and that conversation that enriches our lives. Visit sustainabilityprofessional.org for more about profiles in sustainability excellence and other exciting programs from ISSP, the world's leading professional association of sustainability practitioners.